Hi, I'm Sandeep Dillon, and this is Pretty Fanatic. Um, it's our first YouTube video for you today. I'm here with Ryan Vogelsong, pitcher from the San Francisco Giants. He's had an incredible year and was nice enough to let us into his home. He lives right down the street from me, actually, in North Beach in San Francisco. Um, Ryan, how's your year going? It's been a crazy year. Um, tell us yeah, about it. Yeah, it's good. I'm glad to be here and be part of this team. Fun. Dream come true. Yeah, dream come true. Jumping with joy. <laughs> yes. All star game. How how was that experience for you? It was good. Bochy didn't put me in, but I can forgive him. It's fine. Well, he wanted you healthy for the season, yeah. so yeah. you know. Yes. Well, like so many other you know girls and and people that don't really know too much about sports, <laughs> I'm always really fascinated by the different grips that pitchers hold on the ball to actually you know get the spin on it and get the curve on it that they want. So Ryan here is going to show us. You want to zoom in on the different pitches and and how he holds the seams on the ball. Okay. So if you want to hold it out yeah. and maybe just show us, so basically everyone can get an idea. This is a four seam fastball. This is like the most basic pitch. Um, it's the fastest one pitchers throw because it touching four four parts of the seams with your fingers. Uh, that's a two seam fastball. What's the difference between a four seam and a four two seam? Four seams faster than a two seam. At a two seam, it sort of moves uh, like into a hitter, so it moves this way. So it's a little bit like of a, it just messes up the hitter a little bit with the movement. It's hard for them to read. Hard for them to read it, yeah. Okay. The, the, you can't see the seams either. You can't judge it when you're batting. Okay. And then uh, circle change up. You kind of hold it like this, and you make a circle with your fingers underneath, and then you just throw it just like a fastball. So they can't tell you're throwing a change up, but the change comes in with the speed, or it's going to go a lot slower, like 10 miles an hour difference, but lower. So they're going to swing way ahead of the ball. Uh, and then a curveball. You basically, where the seam, the seam starts curving, you're going to put your middle finger right there, and then when you throw it, you're not going to throw it like a regular pitch, but you're going to curve your arm, like sort of like you're going to handshake someone like that, okay. like when you end up. So you just want to curve it like that, and the ball will curve like, you know, 12 to 6 on the clock, and the pitcher will hopefully swing over it. Okay. And then one more pitch. This is a good one. This is an important one. It's a splitter. So you, it helps if you have big hands, which I don't, but you put your fingers like this over the top seam and you just grip it and then you throw it like a fastball and the ball will drop about six inches uh, at pretty fast speed. Nice. So what's your go-to pitch when you need to strike someone out? Uh, probably the two-seam fastball inside corner. All right, cool. Well, fans, this has been a great inside uh, view with Ryan Vogelsong from the Giants. We wish him the best of luck the rest of the season. and. Thank you for taking the time yeah. to um, show no us some, some pitches. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Yeah.